today we're going to recreate the lead bass synth from Save the Name by clipping. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, boom. Candlesticks in the dark, visions of bodies being burned. Candlesticks in the dark, visions of bodies being burned. And here's the recreation. Let's load our lovely Pookie Bear serum. This is what we need to do. Start off by changing oscillator A to basic underscore MCB and increase the WT position to 146. Decrease the phase to 0 degrees and random phase to 0%. And then we can enable oscillator B and change this to a sine wave. Increase the WT position to 164 and set this to FM. Increase it to 66% and also bring down the phase and random to zero. Decrease the oscillator B to minus one octave and enable the filter. Set it to MG low 18 and enable it to oscillator B as well and toggle this icon as well. Decrease the cutoff to around 460 hertz and make sure that you also decrease, increase the drive to around 20%. Now that we're done here, we can head to the LFO tool and create a shape like this. Amazing. Make sure that the mode is set to envelope and leave the rate as it is at one fourth. Let's add this to the cutoff and decrease the range to around 20%. The last thing we need to do in this page is increase the attack to around 10 milliseconds and increase the release to around 400 milliseconds. Amazing! Let's head to the effects tab and enable distortion and let's change this to sign shaper. Decrease the drive to around 20% and decrease the mix to around 43%. Let's have a listen. So, it sounds pretty good, but we need to add one more thing. So our good old friend Valhalla is back. Let's change the decay to 0.2 milliseconds and decrease the mix to 40%. Then what we need to do is decrease the size of the shape to 0% and turn down early and late the fusion to 0%. Under the EQ, um, section, make sure you increase the low cut to around 240 hertz and decrease the high cut to around 2900. And we are done for Valhalla. Let's have a listen to the finished product. So it sounds pretty bang on, but as you probably know in the track, the synth develops over time, like this. I'm going to show you which parameters in Serum you need to change to make that modulation to how it is in the track. Increase the FM warp to around 83% and increase the resonance to around 30%. Under the effects page, make sure that you set the drive to around 33%. Let's have a listen. So yeah, as you can see, these were the things that kind of changed to, to change the sound as it is similarly in the song. But yeah, that is it. Before you click off the video, make sure you click that juicy subscribe button and comment down below if there's a sound that you'd like me to recreate. Have a good one.